This is the uh, regular MP Shield uh, Gen 1. No extra triggers or anything like that, or no special triggers, no special sight stock. Um, and I'm having uh, grip issues with this. So normally, I am used to a double stack system. Okay? So, all clear here. All right, all clear. So, notice uh, what happens with the double stack magazine, my little short and stubbies have a perfect place. They, they're anchored right at the edge here where my fingers naturally uh, curve around, okay? So that makes for extra place to, you know, make that connection back here, right? To get that, get that good forward grip, all right? And it's the same with any uh, double stack system, all right? It's not, it's not an issue, all right? So, like, look at this. This is my old one that I bought when I was uh, 19. Not clear, but on safe. Again, double stack, double stack magazine. And my little, you notice my, I got little short stubby fingers here. But with the double stack, it, it feeds, my fingers bend around the magazine, the pistol grip, uh, more, much more naturally, okay? Go back to the m &P Shield. What this does is, if I'm gonna choke up on it here, all right, let me put a, a mag in here to get some kind of normalcy. Okay, so uh, we are still clear, all right? So, what this does is uh, my fingers are wrapping unnaturally around the uh, handgun to get a to get a good grip on that pistol grip. In order to get high, in order to get high and grip this, this where my ridges are here are he in the middle of the pistol grip instead of the side. All right, it seems seems uh fine right but what's happening is as i'm as i'm choking up on the bat here my index finger is going way forward now it's going way forward and so what it's doing is it's now it's causing me to have to pull back like this so i'm kind of like pushing the trigger back behind the natural extension of my finger whereas on a double stack Right, still clear here. I am more likely to have my finger resting on the the first the first pad here. All right. Sorry, shadows are coming in as the sun's setting, but I'm 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 better suited with this double stack, and my my fingers wrapped farther back so that the trigger is farther forward. All right. So that when it's time for me to squeeze. It's on the pad and it's much more natural, okay? So what I've done is, I went and got this Hogue sleeve, okay, which thickens the, it thickens the grip up some. Not quite the double stack, but it does pull my index finger back, right? See where it is on indexed here by the trigger well? Now back to the original All right look how far forward I am all right where it's like I'm 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 pulling back against my hand where this one right plus the plus the plus the trigger but which is another uh, another mod to this but I'm am able to get my finger back up at the 
point here where I'm not curling so much and causing this weird trigger uh, thing here. And it's much more natural to do that with this Hogue sleeve. This also works with, this is that 10 rounder by, uh, who is it? Pro Mag that everyone talks crap about. I have two fistfuls of these and they're great. Anyway, the fixer little pinky extension, this is still the seven round mag, all right? But the whole grip goes with that and it keeps it, it just feels much more natural like a, uh, a double stack magazine. And it works much more better. Just throwing that out there, I'm not a salesman or anything, but uh, I have noticed uh, a difference in grip and uh, some pretty good uh, changes in my trigger squeeze on this platform, on this platform. So <clears throat> here, with this double, with this uh, uh, Tan Army Baby Nine, it's still double stack. My fingers way back, right? So my 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 pad is able to get right where it needs to be, all right. And so I was able to affect that by getting that that Hogue Beaver Tail, that Handall Beaver Tail sleeve. So just to FYI, in case you might be wondering as you go to smaller platforms, what's going on and trying to manage your trigger. I just hope you guys learn from what I'm learning. I'm not trying to teach you. I'm not one of these high speed dudes. I'm just, as people like to say, a dude. <laughs> Hard of vision, as it were. All right, y'all have a good one.